Unit 8. Lesson 3. Grammar. Objective. Use the first conditional to talk about a possible situation in the future. Activity 1. Look and read. First conditional. If you rest, you will feel better. If you rest, you'll feel better. If I stop, I will not finish my house. If I stop, I won't finish my house. If you do not rest, you will get ill. If you don't rest, you'll get ill. If you rest, you'll feel better. If I stop, I won't finish my house. If you don't rest, you'll get ill. What is the man building? He is building a house. Does he look tired? Yes, he does. What word is at the beginning of each sentence in the orange box? If Are the words in the red box affirmative or negative? Negative. What is the full form of LL? Will. Look at the blue boxes. Are these words verbs or nouns? Verbs. We use first conditional to talk about a possible situation in the future and its result. This means that if a certain condition is met, the result will probably happen. For example, if you study hard, you will pass the test. In this sentence, studying hard is the condition, while passing the test is the possible result of studying hard. Let's look at the sentence patterns. There are two patterns. The first pattern is if plus present will plus verb. For example, if you rest, you will feel better. 
Note that we use a comma after the if clause. Another pattern for the first conditional is will plus verb if plus present. For example, you will feel better if you rest. Note that we don't use a comma before the if clause. The two sentences have the same meaning. Let's look at some examples of first conditional sentences. If you touch it, you will get an electric shock. You will get an electric shock if you touch it. If it rains, we won't have a picnic. We won't have a picnic if it rains. If she doesn't sleep now, she will wake up late. She will wake up late if she doesn't sleep now. Activity 2. Circle the correct option to complete the sentences. One. If my friend comes later, we'll go to the park. 2. If we go to the park, we will see the swans on the lake. 3. We'll stay at home if it rains. 4. If he arrives late, I'll be furious. 5. I won't finish my homework if you don't turn off the TV. 6. If you don't go to bed early, you will feel tired tomorrow. Activity 3. Work in pairs. Complete the sentences with your own ideas. For example, if it's sunny tomorrow, we'll go sailing. I'll be late for school if I don't find my phone. If I have enough money, I will travel around the world. I won't go out on Saturday if it rains. <laughs>